up mga kachuwari wap, nandito naman kayo sa pangalawang episode ng aking channel which is Guitar Playing Wow! Yan, marami kasing nagsasabi na napakahirap daw mag-gitara or buti pa siya nakakapag-play Actually, lahat tayo pwedeng-pwede at kaya naman natin ayaw lang nating subukan Okay, ano nga ba ang gitara, malamang instrument. Oh no! Ngayon, marami kasing klase or maraming pamamaraan pagdating sa pagpa-play ng gitar. Merong plucking, may strumming, merong finger style, at marami-rami pang ibang. Pero dito sa episode ko, yung pinaka-basic lang, using the fundamental elements of music. Sa gitara, kadalasan, ang ginagamit or mas kilala is the acoustic guitar and the electric guitar. Pero, meron din tayong classical guitar. So, classical guitar. Classical guitar is a guitar that is classic. <laughs> classical guitar, usually ang classical guitar ay may merong mas malaking body and it uses nylon. Okay? Tingnan sa picture sa taas. Ngayon, pag sinabi mo ng acoustic guitar, yan yung kadalasan yung bit ng mga high school yan, acoustic guitar and electric guitar yung kadalasan na nakikita nyo sa banda ang dami ko na namang sinabi eto na, simulan na natin yeah! okay punta tayo doon sa mismong gitara okay ang gitara ay mayroong Anim na strings. Wow! <laughs> Merong anim na strings at ina-identify sila according sa number nila. Okay? Ang number nila ay nagsisimula sa baba. This is the first sa baba, second, third, fourth, fifth, and sixth. See? It has six strings. <laughs> Ngayon, ang gitara ay kadalasan nasa key of C tuning. Okay? Huwag na natin i-discuss yun kasi masyadong malawak na pag-aaral yun. Oh, no. so, basic lang tayo. Ngayon, tandaan nyo lang na kapag nagtutono ng gitara, ang standard na key of C ay nasa Eddie, Eight, Dynamite, Good, by Eddie. Palitan natin. Eddie, Eight, Dynamite, Good, by Eddie. So, kung babalikan nyo yung um, elementary lesson natin pagdating sa do, uh, music, the do, re, mi, pa, sol, la, ti, do, or the sofa syllables, meron silang alphabetical representation. So, do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. So, C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. So, wow. kung ito ay E, so, C, D, E, So, Do, Re, Mi. So, Mi, Do, Mi. And ganun din sa iba. Okay? Now, paano ba nag-iiba-iba ang tono ng gitara? Yan yung function ng frets natin. This is the fretboard starting from here up until to here. That is the fretboard. And these lines are the frets. Okay? So, kung ito ay E, okay, pag diniinan mo siya dito, this is already F. This, then, the second fret is F sharp. G, G sharp, A, A sharp, B, sharp. Yan. Basta ganun siya. So, pag nandito ka sa dulong, mas mababa. Pag nandito ka sa dulong kabila, mas mataas. So, that's how you do it. Now, next is the tuning. Ginagampanan yan ni tuning pegs. Siya yung naghihila ng lahat ng strings. Siya si tuning pegs. Okay? So, hindi ikot-ikot yan dyan. Ngayon, 
Sir, tama na ang chika. Yeah. Dami mo nang sinabi. Yung tayo, gusto na namin mag-play ng gitara. Okay, relax. Ito na. Kalma. Okay. Doon tayo, maraming klase ng chords. May augmented, may minor, may major. Pero doon tayo sa melodic pattern muna. Melodic pattern na kadalasan at mas madali siyang kabisahin. This is F sharp. Bar chords yan. So this is bar. Gumagamit ka ng bar. Huwag muna kasi nahihirapan ka talaga. Okay? Ngayon, I suggest that you start with a melodic pattern. Pwedeng mag-start ka sa G. Okay? G. This is D. This is E minor. And this is C. Okay. Doon tayo sa G. Okay. Ang G ay index finger sa second fret. Okay. Fifth string. And then third fret sixth string. And then second string yung yung ring finger pero sa 3rd fret and then 3rd fret din yung yung pinky or the little miss philippines <laughs> ano tawag dito pinky oh, yan so, ang alam ko si pinky siya eh. okay so tingnan nyo yung shape that's G okay next is the D Maraming mga chord chart na available na sa Google. So, kung gusto mo na mag-explore ng iba't ibang klase ng, ng chords, gusto mo na, and feeling mo kaya mo na, go on. Spread your wings. Yeah. <laughs> so, this is D. This is the shape of D. Now, paano ba ginagawa ang D? Index finger sa third string, second fret. Okay. And then, second fret also, yung middle finger, pero first string. Okay? And then, the ring finger is the second string, pero third fret. So, okay? That's how you do it. It's D. So, C, magkaibang D in, magkaibang tunog. Yeah. And then E minor is like this, dalawa lang. The mid, uh, the index finger and the middle finger on the second fret for the uh, fifth and ano, uh, the fourth and the fifth string. Yan. Sir, pwede bang ganito? Pwede naman, kasi sabi ko nga kanina, yung fret magbabago lang yung tone niya kapag lumagpas na dun sa isang line. Okay? Ganyan or ganyan parehas lang naman ng tunog niyan. So, it doesn't matter. What matters the most is kung paano mo diniin at kung saan fret mo diniin at kung anong string mo diniin. Kuha ba yun? Yeah! Ayun. That's E minor. Okay? And then the C first fret index finger Second string, second fret, third string, and then ano no? Uh. Second fret, middle finger, fourth string, and then third fret, which is the <coughs> ring finger sa fifths. Okay. Fifths. Okay. okay. So, this is the shape. Okay. Kung medyo nalilito, pwede kayong pumunta sa or mag-download ng chart ng guitar chords. So, meron tayong G. Meron tayong D. Meron tayong E minor. Meron tayong C. Okay. So, apat na chords lang yan na pwede nyo nang magamit sa maraming klase or maraming kanta. Now, dalawang klase ang pagpiplay ng gitara. 
Merong plucking, basically, ha? May, pl may plucking at merong strumming. Pag sinabi mong strumming, That's how you do the strumming. Pero kapag plucking, So, see what's the difference of the two. Yeah. Ngayon, paano ba piniplay? Strumming lang muna tayo ha, kasi basic, basic lang muna tayo. Kasi pag nag-plucking, nakakalitan na yung masyado. So, basic lang muna tayo. Strumming wise, is very important dito ang time signature. So, it, it is about the rhythm and about the Tempo. Balik tayo, gamitin natin yung four chords na tinuro ko kanina. So, halimbawa, four four time signature, so meron kang four beats. Okay? Pag two four, meron kang two beats. Pag three four, meron kang three beats per meter. Paano yun? Ganito. Halimbawa, four four muna. Like, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and 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 one. Okay, so that is the four. Four. Sa isang chord, dapat merong kang two, three, four, four beats. Yeah. And then, pag two, four naman, two beats. So, one, two, See, there's a difference. Depende sa kung paano mo piniplay at paano yung areglo noong music na tutugtugin mo. Personally ako, I started playing guitar before during my high school days. And I started sa isang song ni Jason Meras na kasikatan before which is I'm Yours. Ngayon, yung, ko, yung kantang yun is for ano lang siya, um, four chords, yung tinuro ko kanina, magagamit niyo sa kanya. Ngayon, sample. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, so I won't hesitate. Good sa lahat na magta-try mag-aral ng gitara. Go on! Mas maganda that you expose yourself when it comes to instruments and music rather than spending a lot of time when it comes to the social media. The, no, kasi skill siya guys. Skills. Kung nagustahan niyo tong episode na to ng guitar playing, don't forget to hit like and subscribe to my channel para updated kayo sa lahat ng ina-upload ko video. Okay? Yeah! Yan. Huwag kakalimutan to spread love, love your neighbor, love everybody else, love the country, love the world, love the environment, spread love, and peace out.